This is the dryer motor with the centrifuge switch here. I took this plate out. You can see clearly they have the contact here. And uh, take a look at the drawing first. This is uh, the centrifuge switch. When motor spin, this will go to the here, make the M1 and the M2 connected. So you can see on this plate, M1 is here, M2 is here on both left and the right hand side. I used the multimeter probe to connect this. So when I use hand to simulate motor spin, so this contact will close here. So this contact. So this contact go connect to here, to the left hand side, and this one go to the right hand side. So I simulate, you can hear the meter, the beep sound. Watch here, this is a close right now. If you simulate this, like the motor spinning, you push this in, but this one is not close. So there's a something wrong. All you can see the contact uh, burned. So that's you need to replace. If you hear the sound, that means the central field switch is working. Thank you for watching. If you like this short video, please hit the like button and the subscribe. You also might have the question, can I check this centrifuge switch without taking the motor out of the dryer? I have the answer for you. Take a look at this video, how to quickly check the centrifuge switch without taking the motor out of the dryer. Thank you. See you next time.